Hello, humans, I'm Yo Schiller, and welcome back to some more Donkey Kong 1994 for the Game Boy. In the previous parts, I cleared up World 8, the longest world of this game. And in this part, I shall begin the final world of this game, which is known as the Tower. Now, there's only eight levels in this world, and much like the previous worlds of this walkthrough, I'm going to be doing four levels at a time per each video, and you can find timestamps for each of the levels that I'm doing in this part in the description below. However, these levels function differently than a majority of the previous levels in this game, and I'll demonstrate that in just a moment. But here we go, guys! It's the final world! I'm nearing the closure of this game! Okay. So, every single level in this world is a Donkey Kong slash Donkey Kong Jr. boss fight. Now, obviously, I've had my fair share of boss fights in this game, which is why I said it's unlike a majority of the other levels. I've already died! That's, that's miserable. But, the point is... Uh, is that you're not really puzzle, you're not really solving puzzles in these levels. You're not really carrying keys to doors anymore. Like that last level that I did in the in the previous part. Yeah, that was the last level in which I have to carry a key to any sort of door. So, oh, I guess I don't have to do anything over here. I don't know what that would particularly do. Hey, okay, so, oh, oh, okay. So I can, I just gotta wait. Oh, that pesky little enemy is destroying me. Wow, this is, this is miserable. This isn't even a hard level. I just keep screwing everything up. I don't even need to hit that, that switch over to the left because Donkey Kong, Donkey Kong Jr. is in control of everything. So, it's like, whatever. This level theoretically could, could be completed in, in a couple of seconds. Come on, Donkey Kong Jr. Oh, oh, actually, I do need to hit that switch because that switch opens the door. Silly me. Let me do that. So, I did have to do that. It was not in vain. Can I pick you up? Yes, I can. I'm going to get you out of my way. Thank you. And then now we're just going to go down here. We're going to ride this up. Well, okay, maybe not. I'm just going to slowly dodge everything or not. You know, I'm, I am falling apart. I apologize. Don't worry. There's only like two or three more parts left to this walkthrough. See, so there's not too much more failure to see. And of course, if I fail far too often, I can always just cut all this out. I'm not afraid to show my mistakes, humans. I'm not. I'm not afraid to say that I'm not a pro at the games that I play. Because it's evident that I'm, I'm, uh, that I'm not a pro at the games that I play. So, I mean, why lie? You guys are going to figure it out eventually. Okay. Switch lever, whatever you want to call it. Let's chill here for a second. Yeah. I don't know if that's if those are like hats that are going toward me. I'm not 100% sure. Here we go. Just got to hang in there. Okay, now I've just got to wait here for a second. And this level is over! Hi, Pauline! But of course, as we all saw on the map, there are seven more levels to this world and three more levels to this part. So that's just one level. But that's a general understanding of how these levels are going to work, is that they're all Donkey Kong and Donkey Kong Jr. boss fights, and there is no way for you to gain extra lives at this point. There are no collectibles on each of these levels because they are boss fights. So, hopefully you'll have a fair share of lives, like me, because... I've gotten, like, pretty much... Actually, I, I got every single collectible on every single level. So, I am very pleased with my end result. Okay. Junior, I need you to pull that freaking lever. Thank you. Oh, yeah. Hey, yeah. What? No, I touched the top of a trampoline and it killed me? Dude. Mario has been bouncing on trampolines and jumping straight into the sky for years and just touching that one is the end of me. Okay. Okay. Just gotta do things the old fashioned way. I got it. Just gotta go, 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 go. It's okay. Now, I could do a triple jump, but I'm not. I don't think I'm gonna be able to pull this up. Oh, I did it. Well, what do you know? Oh, come on, Donkey Kong! Come on with this! <sighs> well, that wasn't even a triple jump. That was just uh, a handstand flip thing. I don't, I don't, I don't know. Whatever it is, it wasn't a triple jump. But I guess that just goes to show that I don't need to do a triple jump to get through this part of the game. So, I right, okay, that's going up. Nope. Okay. So it's this easy. There we go. Okay, that level was over. Thankfully, that one was completed in a rather quick manner. These levels are actually a bit easier than the levels I played in the previous worlds. It's just getting to the end. Using the mechanics of this game, of course. It's, it's not a traditional platformer by any means, but... Okay, stage 9-3 of the tower. Here we go. Let's do it. Let's do it. Oh, you see, this one This one looks like it's going to be a bit trickier. 
Though again, all I have to do is get to the end. That shouldn't be too bad. Hmm. Okay, so that little school enemy is just just gonna go around. That's fine. As long as he doesn't touch me. Good. Okay, those guys are gonna go through each other. Ooh, this could this could prove to be a little tricky. I don't suppose I can jump on them because they have spikes on their heads. So it's, I just gotta be patient. This is the level about patience. Come on, open the doors, please. Okay, or don't. I'll keep jumping through these guys. It's fine. At what point does the door open? I need these doors to be open. Am I just stuck in here forever? Yep. Alright, well that was not how I was supposed to do things. I have lost so many lives already. These levels are not that hard. It's not, it's not even a puzzle. It's not a puzzle. It's just me trying to get through the level. I just, just can't do it. Okay, I guess I'm stuck here now. Maybe those mushrooms do have a use. Here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Woo! Yay! I did it, everybody. I don't know if I can just climb this. Oh, that's... Okay! I'm gonna wait here! Okay, you pesky skull... Cow skull enemies. You are ruining my day. I just want to beat Donkey Kong 1994 for the Game Boy today because there's only like two or three parts left. I just want to be able to record those and I want to be on my happy jolly way and I want to be, be able to move on to the next game. Record something else. I love this game. It's very well structured. But it's like, man, I don't. if I wanted to spend a few extra minutes with this game, I would just replay an older level. I don't, I don't have to be stuck on this one because of these, these tedious cow skull enemies. I gotta wait. That's just the moral of the story is I gotta, I gotta wait. There you go. I'm going over you. Please, the doors. Okay, I don't think it's gonna happen, so I'm gonna wait back over here. Okay. Yes. Is it safe? Is it safe? And go through here? Yes! Thank you! Okay. Awesome. Come on. Up with the ladder. Okay. I'm okay here. It's safe. I'm safe here, as long as they don't get hit by a mushroom. Which it won't hit me because these things are not in play. Junior, can you can you flip the switch, please? Oh my, thank you. Is that what it was waiting for? It was waiting for me to get out of the way? There we go! Finally done with this. I just barely landed on that platform, but okay, that level is finally over. <laughs> okay. Woo! Let's go. Stage 9-4 is up next, and this is the last level that I'm recording for this part, so here we go. I think this is a more traditional Donkey Kong boss fight in which I throw the barrels at him. Yeah. Ooh, actually, no, it's not. This is like a Donkey Kong Jr. type of level where I have to get these keys up here. Oh, and I gotta dodge you. Right. So if, if you guys remember stuff I explained in a previous part, or if you guys remember just the mechanics of Donkey Kong, you're faster climbing up when you grab onto two vines. You are faster going down when you're only hanging onto one vine. Now, you can't climb a vine at all if a mushroom hits you, so... That's tedious, and obviously these bird droppings will destroy me in one hit. So there's a little, there's a lot going on. Alright, here we go. Come on. Ah, okay, let's get both of these. And back down, or not, you know. That I thought I could make it. I, was, I, I guess I could not make it, so let's try that again. That, that's my commentary, guys. I thought I could make it, and uh, I guess I can't make it. So here we go, just gotta hurry. No! And I'm getting hurt from fall damage. Don't want that to happen too often. Okay, now the birds are coming out. Here we go. Here we go, come on. There's an easy way to do this boss fight. Go, go, go! That's how you do this boss fight quickly. You just do it quickly. You, you just do it quickly. Okay. Let's go. Why with this? And then I'm rolling. I'm rolling. It's okay. Okay, come on. We good? The bird droppings are gone? Sort of. Yeah. Okay, one more key. One more key. Let's go. Hurry! What? What? But that was the last key. Did I just have to wait for the cutscene to finish? Oh my god. Okay. I have lost so many lives in this world. I'm so sorry, humans. I really am. Nope. Nope. We go. Thankfully, I can't knock the keys down. Here we go. Yeah, yeah. Okay, here we go. Come on. Uh. 
Let's go. Alright. Oh. Uh. Okay. No! Those birds! <laughs> the birds, man! The birds! Okay. Okay. Oh, nope. Let's go. Okay. There. Now what? Oh, I just had to wait for a cutscene to finish playing. That's why I couldn't beat this the first time. Ah, whatever. That was weird. I just magically teleported up there. Whatever. Okay, that's the first four levels of this world, which is a pretty, which is a pretty interesting world. And then, okay, it's gonna reteach me some old mechanics. I can backflip over those. If I'm on my hands. I can kick the barrels away with my feet, and then I can pick them up and throw them. That will be important. That will be an important mechanic. So, be sure to remember that. Now, I've got a bunch of points. That'll get me plenty of lives. That'll make up for all the lives that I lost in this world. Well, I think I had like 91, 92 coming into this world. I'm at 85 now. It's whatever. It still gives me plenty of lives. And here we go, guys. I am reaching the final four levels of this world, which means that the next part of this walkthrough could very well be the final part of this walkthrough. For now, that wraps up this part of Donkey Kong 1994 for the Game Boy, and I would like to thank you all for watching. See you all next time in the next part when I take on the final four levels of this world. And the final four levels of the game. Bye bye humans! Hey, thank you very much for watching this video. If you're new here, then please allow me to give you a quick rundown of things that you can do right now. I post new videos every single day at noon Pacific time. On the weekdays, I usually post walkthroughs and let's plays and all that good stuff. And on the weekends, I usually post online matches with friends and fans. However, I also create all sorts of other videos. If it's Nintendo, then I'll probably do something related to it. So if you'd like to show me your support, you can click the like button on this video. Or you can leave a comment telling me what you think about the video, or you can leave a request. If you want to see more content from me, then please feel free to click the subscribe button to see all of my latest content. You can also follow me on Twitter. My tag is at RealYoShiller, because YoShiller was taken. Right now, there's also a bunch of videos on the screen. If you click one, you'll be redirected to a video or a playlist. Like I said, I create all sorts of Nintendo-related content, so chances are, if you watch this video, there's something that'll catch your interest. Once again, thank you all so much for watching, and I hope to see you guys around in the future. Bye bye humans Whoosh!